This is Joe again and welcome back to Stasis Bone Totem today without camera because uh, it's summer and sun's shining through the window and thus cam lighting is completely impossible to properly set up. But we're here and want to freaking incinerate this oil. Whoa! Screen flashed over here. You okay? Yeah. Whatever this is, it's really flammable. The heat coming off it is intense. Rudimentary technology. Primitive culture. Big power source. <sighs> That's what I'm hoping. So this should now, if I'm allowed to move. Did you just step on it? I'm pretty certain I saw you step on it. This should now ignite everything here. And light everything. Again, yeah, now we have a problem though. <sighs> Holy shit, the whole place looks like it's burning. Language, Mac. Thought this whole place burning was what you wanted. Not with you in it. Um. What? That was actually more a joke than anything else. So it's not the walkway that is burning, it is coming from the ramp. Okay, that is an isometric trick played on me. Okay, so now this should have activated stuff here. Ooh, this machine now. Twitching as it's quivering in hunger and anticipation. The rope thing is turning and now we just need to freaking somehow... We ah, okay. This has served its purpose, so the only purpose was giving us the audio cue on how to uh, operate the thing above. The fire, it... it started everything spinning. Yeah, we know that. You act like you're superior to everything here. But you're just as trapped as I am. Just as helpless. We're all oh. trapped here now. Thanks to you. Can you not oh, even begin to understand? You heard her too. That wasn't her. That wasn't her. Who are you trying to convince? Me? Or you? He's trying to Hope convince himself, but he thinks alive. he's right still. Okay, that was kind of weird. That mechanism doesn't make any sense. I don't like the looks of this. Indeed. My knowledge of this place ends here. You are about to enter a part of the temple no one has ever explored before. It is impossible to predict what you will find beyond. I don't see any other choice. This whole place is connected. We'll find each other. The only way out now is through. Where all we've got left. You are wasting time. Yeah. We are. Is this... Oh, that is a chapter. Okay. That's... I didn't expect the chapter to end here. We are all we've got left. Yes. Indeed. That was the case the entire time. Okay, some judge, a clock, a sarcophagus, a spirit door, some glyphs, a golden skull. Let's look a bit around. The door, the door sealed behind me. Not going back that way. Where are you? <sighs> Looks like a, well, a crypt. Uh, like Veron said, some kind of sarcophagus in the middle of the room too big one we saw yeah. pictures of this one Not unsettling in the at first all. chapter I think a doorway fashioned from a single stone block could lead to the underworld some glyphs a golden sky framed by an arched crown of steel thorns bearing an emblazoned sigil of authority and reverence 
in spirit door. In this primitive belief system, behind it lies pathways to another realm. Scary door. Stay, Charlie. I can't, sweetheart. I can't. Dagger in face. No? Bomb in face? Radiation shield in face? Scrubber in face? Grenade in face? Beans you want to eat. Okay, no, we don't have the tool yet. We have the sarcophagus and that clock. Let, let, let's look at the clock. Why did that move? Uh, we're gonna look at the other parts of this over here. I do not like this. I'm with the bear, disturbing the dead. Never a good thing. They look so mutated. Why? What's in there? Primitive ritualistic symbolism. Its use within this room is predictable. It will allow exit. 81% accuracy prediction. That's only... 81, huh? First of all, you say you said you were always on 82% accurate. Second of all, that is only true, that is only accurate, if this is an adventure game. Oh, I can just slide it like that. Okay, we've seen this kind of deal. If you ever watched any movies. This is the curse of the mummy. Yeah. Charlie? Warning. Volatile contaminants detected. Initiate quarantine and sterilization protocols immediately. Charlie! Okay. <coughs> I'm okay. You will need what is inside. Do you know what you just exposed her to? She came down here, risked everything for you, and she... The female's chances of survival are about 50%. A necessary risk margin. And an acceptable one. You... What do you mean, necessary? <coughs> Stupid Mac? thing. I am your taxi I, I have explained already. Kane has no power here. Only I do. Get that? Get that thing? Okay, apparently not. A death mask. It seems molded from a particularly hardy type of leather, though I'd rather not know where they sourced it from. We're not taking that one? Is there any reason for that clock to exist? It's just moving on its own accord. I assume we need it for some kind of puzzle. But apparently it doesn't do anything about the sarcophagus. Yeah, so Mr. Face and Wall, you get in your face. As I colluded, ritualistic vestiges were required. <coughs> what, what is... What did I inhale? My Charlie. Okay, why is these two interactions? Okay, this is a puzzle. And the key to the puzzle is the clock. But what time do we need? What time do we need? Okay, we have scribble different scribble and different scribble okay you can't really tell apart by the by the handles here i mean this is a long scribble and this is splotch scribble uh, let's see whether that 
is somewhere here on the door. That would be the easiest solution. It isn't. Great, so that doesn't tell us what order to do this in. Also, we don't have anything else to look at here. We just see this face. This face here tells us something. But does that mean we're going to point the middle handle at it? Or the right? Or the left one? Is it even one of the symbols here? It is that one. It is that one. And that's the one that will not be shown. So I assume it's like this, where it would point, the other direction would point at that one. But now we need this, this and this. So the wearly butterfly shaped one, the vaguely jade Aztec one, and the weird purple one. Okay. Let's find one of those. Ah, it only has one now. What? Why do I... Get distortion. Ah, yeah, of course. Every time. Fucking hell. Yeah, there's always this weird thing about when I'm getting a call that, like, 20 seconds earlier or something like that. No, like, 10 seconds earlier, I already get radio headphone distortion stuff. Okay, so when we started this up, this upper thing had two circles when I right click. That might have been an artifact from when I put the mask in before. But I want to double check. I've seen all three things that I... That was the thing. Great. I want to go back to the one where we started at. This one. Because this one looked... Okay, on this... This had like two circles and it was like posed as if like we could actually pierce something into the skull there but that's not how it works that's not how it interacts so we're putting the things here that i thought we saw uh, might have been that one definitely that one okay either order matters making this one the third Wait, 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 wait. We had one thing telling us something about count counterclockwise. Not clockwise, counterclockwise. So this one has to be the weird thing that's now on the top and bottom. Or on the other hand, this is on the guy's chest. Let's look at that again. This is the symbol on the guy's chest. The question is, is it the upper symbol or is this the middle symbol? Let's say it's the upper symbol. And we're go going counterclockwise but toward to bottom. That would mean that on the clock we go this way. So putting this thing on the top, the butterfly at the bottom, and the red skull and on the left. Great, thank you. Uh, the red skull in the middle and the butterfly on the bottom. No. Going counterclockwise. And it's not the top. If it's the middle, that means that this one is not on the table. This one's the red one, and we go for the green skull here. That would be that direction, this thing in the middle. That's not how it works. We have no more clues with her. Let's look around.
he couldn't continue because he didn't have anything to repair this right yes we tried all these things um take a look at that yeah i don't even know i think the only clue i have in the back of my head was not here did we have some extensive notes in any of these places i don't think so we had like pda stuff yeah but not these extensive yeah okay that here this down that might be the clock although it doesn't look like one this might be something totally different but that's uh, that's actually the drawing that i'm referring to it's been a while since i like recorded the last episode before this so had to read double check where i got that idea from okay with moses we were stuck because he didn't want to continue here and he doesn't even have any interaction point so we're supposed to figure this out with her and i'm again stumped because i have no idea where to start with the fucking puzzle where do i start let's say this is top let's say that is top why does it go weirdly around why okay it actually goes that direction do i just need to put in the current time it goes randomly around great great it goes randomly around <laughs> and blue skull weird ugly face and thing with stuff on the temple of the head that is that thing with the temple on the head is not part of this the, that one this might be the thing the ugly thing with the things on the on the bottom Nah, here yeah, there's there's faces here that are not real like that are not part of the other one i do not understand do we need to activate the hint system again yeah fuck hell I need I need a tiny hint. I don't want a walkthrough to tell me the solution. I don't need a walkthrough to tell me the solution. I want a fucking hint. A tiny one. Clock face. Okay, we do it this way. Save the game, create save file, load game, load that save file. And now, when I go here, hints are disabled. No hints are on. Okay. Don't want to go everywhere again. I just see this, but I don't know what part of the hint it is. Is it his ugly face? Then that? And then we just brute force? Is that all that we need for the solution? His ugly face? Um, that might be the closest.
And this thing? Help. Uh, I hate being stuck on a puzzle with no... There's like no indication on whether we need more hints or something. Like we... Ah, this is so super frustrating. Like that's the most frustrating part about puzzle games. Like, do I have all the clues? Where do I even look for clues? Uh, right to left, left to right, top to bottom, whatever. One of them is made out of bone and tied on. That's the one that's most, like, distinct from the others. Let's say that's in the middle and then red and green. Didn't I try that? That's in the middle uh, together with red and green. I did try that before, didn't I? We have to go all the way around. And that doesn't work. The question is, do I mistake one for the other because they look, they look similar? No. Okay. This is the other one. I just clicked on that one. I just clicked on that one. And now we take blue. This is like a two-part puzzle. So we take blue. That had a different sound to it. And now we take red for the middle. That didn't sound like the solution. Now we pu put red at the... So if red is at the mid... That's the... That one's the middle. If red's at the middle, we need to put a butterfly and the green thing. If red's at the middle, we need to put a butterfly and the green thing, which didn't work, so we have put the butterfly and the green thing in the other order. No. Um, hello? I activated hints game? I have no fucking idea what you mean. Can you stop flying around, flies? Uh, you are fucking annoying me. Yeah, I know that I can't attack with anything here. <sighs> this is so super annoying. Hint, please. Hint, please. Yeah, okay. Um, do we admit, admit defeat? Do we stop playing this game because the game didn't explain its puzzle and there's no more pieces to this? We have this, which is everything we have. And it might be the top part. It might not be. That is all the hints we have. We cannot go back with Moses to the thing, uh, to the terminal that had the, uh... Fucking hell, we can. And it wasn't in a lock. It wasn't in a lock. It wasn't in a conversation. It was on a terminal. It was on a terminal. 
uh, once we came down from deep sea 15 to the Mu, that's where we found um, x-ray scannings of this sarcophagus or a sarcophagus like this that thing might help us ports webs Oh, I like having no, not solved a single puzzle today because all the puzzles were solved yesterday that we're still working from. 25 minutes of nothing. And now we go around. These are all documents. These, these can't have. And he also doesn't have normal terminals to look at. He has, he has like that PDA, but that doesn't help. But he is at least in a structure that is adjacent. Like it's built by the same people. He could have a thing. Moses is in our recycling facility. Like that, that, that uh, no, in, uh, she, he isn't in a recycling facility anymore. Any uh, donations? No. And that is the only interactable we have besides this one. But this one also just tells me about something returning, turning clockwise, anti-clockwise. Oh, it's so frustrating. If like. Like it's not that I'm stupid, just I probably don't remember the hints that we saw the pda doesn't help because it doesn't have photos the terminal could help but we don't have terminus anymore we have left civilization with all three characters and up there is only the battery thing yes That's another two minutes gone to just wandering around and confirming that there is nothing to look at because that is a PDA. So I think all the solutions we have to come up with in our head. The problem is that we have no clues at all. Like with zero clues. And that's so frustrating. Like, all the clues we need should be in here somewhere. Okay, there is the thing with the golden helmet that's obviously the king that they're revering. That's the only other type of adorning that they have in this room. And then we have the fucking spirit door. Okay. Okay, some are never properly aligned. That is interesting. If we speak of proper alignment, we only have it now. No, not even now. Oh, is that stupid? And I don't even know what one, two, three means in your fucking language. Uh. Okay, when I press it, it could it it goes clockwise. It goes clockwise, and at the top we have this thing, meaning that this would be green. And this would be the butterfly. Isn't this the first thing we tried? If it were going the other way around, counterclockwise, and at the top we have that, then this would be the solution. That is also not true. So you're not at the top. Wait, your, f your head is 
Your head has a line on top of it. Your head doesn't have a line on top of it. This is part of the helmet. And below the grinning face, there is this weird structure. The weird structure is here. But this is like protruding upwards in some kind of weird thing that I'm trying to find something that which whose lower end ends with that. I don't find it. Okay. I'm trying like look at ah yeah. It always looks like this. Great. So this thing is the thing that's on his sarcophagus. Did we try this in both orders? <sighs> the problem is I've tried so many times that I don't know. I say counterclockwise. Red, butterfly, green. Wasn't that the very first thing I tried? That was the first thing I tried. That says the other way around, then is red is down here. We did try this twice already, didn't we? Yeah. Okay. Let's say you are my clue to listen for audio clues. Do we wait for it to spin on of, of its own? We know that it spins, but it only ever has spun off screen. What about waiting until it spins on screen? This could take an eternity because it might not spin. This is literally the same noise, the exact same noise. It's the same audio sample. I don't know what to do. Um, so we first off, we say thank you to the game for the hint system not working because this puzzle Sure as hell is missing a solution, but now I'm looking up how to continue. That's too stupid for me. Like, I could brute force this, try for three hours, and then still don't understand how it worked. I'm just looking up what the next part of my solution is. Great, I needed three minutes to research something that I'm pretty certain I already put in and didn't work. So... The freaking middle face of the thing is pointing towards this, and then left and right are pointing to the others. And then we go counterclockwise. So, first one's pointing at this, and the other one at the red. Wait. This is the correct one. You're kidding me? This is the one that my. Probably I'm wrong. Ah, got, okay. Got, oh. So, counter... Got clockwise, it. not counter clockwise. Okay, Charlie, good. Whatever. how do you feel? Uh, not good. Kind of annoyed by this room. So, I basically had figured this out and already tried this. 
pretty certain I tried every combination of those three, but I might be wrong. Remains of a faded and damp rotted mural cling to the interior of the elk of hints of vibrant colors from the ghost of a regal figure adorned in gold. Caliban, what did you mean before? When you said she had better than 50% chance of surviving? I can collate no other combination of words that might explain more adequately. Why a 50% chance? What did she inhale? The Velis, I'm afraid. The Vel- Oh, oh no. God. No. <coughs> Tali. Wait. Oh, wait, what? <coughs> I am very sorry, Charlie. But I can think of nothing else your plug suit detectors would label a volatile contaminant in this environment. My Charlie. That plant-based stuff we've been seeing in the body since we got here? She's infected with it? Accuracy prediction, 100%. Oh. Oh. Okay. Uh, how fast can it spread? Uh, I mean, she was just exposed to it. Its maturation period is within hours. If she does not reach the surface very quickly... Okay. Okay, okay. very quickly to the surface. Only decreases her odds of survival. Then shut up. And yours, you son of a bitch. Accuracy prediction, 100%. 100% that he's the son of a bitch? I think so too. Okay, a next room. There's a weird statue. And a weird pillar. Cranial curtain of skulls. Ah, those are skulls. Okay. Wow, I need to look very closely to see that. Some rock floor, another carved figure, another sarcophagus. The organs are removed and carefully weighed to determine the deceased's fate afterlife. Once balance was achieved, the spirits would ascend. How do you know that? Baron said no one's explored this area. Rudimentary visual comparative analysis of primitive cultures of similar geographic regions. 91% accuracy prediction. <coughs> also sounds like uh, some European. Have to <coughs> keep stuff. going. Weighing the the organs of the deceased, didn't isn't that what the Greeks, uh, Greeks underworld did? Okay, take a look at that tapestry. Guy bow down, other guy with. Whatever, weird torture device, but somebody standing on it with a crown, and guys are revering him. Okay, understood. Not at all. Let's go to the mechanism. Jet black insects scuttle into vacant skeletal eyes as you approach, wings fluttering over finger fed abdomens. They had to achieve balance. They had to achieve balance. This is a vivid section tool. Bits of bone and flint are tied together with what looks like a savage metal coil. The simple construction seems almost intentional and ritualistic. Bone, flint, and a metal coil. Hello, you. What was that for? Can't take that apart. No, but... Try that. I should always try to commit suicide in this game. Should not forget about that. But I think that might be... Uh, the kind of spring needed to hold brake clamps together or to make brake clamps go apart when they're stuck. So put coil here. Okay, brake's good to go. Should be able to descend without killing myself now. Mac, please hurry. Okay, Mac can now go downwards. Um, you. I want to take a further look at the altar. Okay, there's a heart against a heart that we're weighing. Cat head viscera jar. Whatever organs were put inside seem to have congealed into a sloshing gray slush. And we have it with a bird head. Weak old vomit stewing in a lock, lock, locked sun-baked lock leaven. Aha. And the ape head. God, when I move it, I can see reams of intestines swirling like intertwined snakes. 
eat that. Why can't we do that? Okay. Baked beans. That's 16. And now we need to... Moses? I'm sorry, I need your scales. Of course, have to try to kill myself. Okay. Ape, ape, weighs four. Okay. Bird, weighs eight. That's twelve together. And twelve. Ape, bird is the same as cat. And cat, ape. Wait, ape was what? Four. And this was 8. 4, 8, 12. Uh, 4, 8, 12. 4, 8, 12. Um, so why do we want the baked beans? Whatever. Um, 4, 8, 12. So 4 and 12. That should be 16. Yeah? What's your problem? And uh, then the ape goes here. And that one goes here. Ah, that works now. Two things equal two things. Oh, ah, because four bodies stench. that have been weighed. And that's why we have the four. bodies would drop into the hole. This would be out of sight of the people. They rose. They would believe they had risen. A primitive culture. The Very primitive. Pain yeah. is any different. It's not the same thing. The Nexus is real. Based on what collation? Based on what evidence? My loyalty to my creators has... It was a good question. I have no personal restrictions on revealing the truths of things publicized. Would you like to know the truth? It is called the Nexus of the Nine, after all. And Newman shepherded it. I can't tell you its truths, its realities, what I cannot tell you. Is if you will like the answers I provide. No. I like my beliefs just as they are. I predicted as much. No, tell me, what is that Nexus? That weird metaverse that Kane has created to make people live their afterlife in. Same thing as in... Was it Soma? Or was it another game? Which one was the game where you like launched the Ark in the end. There was Soma, I think. Oh, man. Oh. Charlie, I'm working my way there. Wait. Just wait. I think I have to go. I think I have to jump. Charlie, God damn it! I think I'm... I, I have a feeling I'm... I'm running out of time. 100% accuracy prediction. My Charlie. That my death now? Is that a death scene? I mean, I could have tried. What grab at me? What grab at what? What grab it? What? What happened there? What grab it? What? Charlie! 
I don't understand. Is okay? Uh, I'm okay. Oh, uh, I'm okay, guys. Where are you? Uh, I'm, uh, I don't know. Uh, it's a cave. Catacombs. And it smells wretched. Nothing but death. It's overwhelming. Uh, uh, uh. Is Charlie okay? No, sweetheart. No. Uh, I'm in a lot of pain. Was it the ball? No, I... I'm... Oh, oh my chest. Oh, my stomach. The contaminant is growing. It will overtake her system. My Charlie. You knew it was in that sarcophagus, didn't you? You had her open it anyway. I told him the Nellis would be present in any decomposed and secret all remnant adequately stored in a contained vessel. 71% accuracy prediction. Mac! When I find you, I am going to rip you to pieces. Your feelings are compromised and useless. You have no true influence in this situation. We'll see. I predict a 74% level of accuracy according to my calculations. I am her best chance for survival. That might be true. Okay. She has gone down to the place where for billions and billions of years by the way they're moving here the weird figures a carpet of distended larvae royal below a mucus surface their heads momentarily breaching the surface as if gasping for air before being dragged back down like this is where they've been disposing of their bodies for thousands of years great and he's going down there too so we're doing the dissension with both of them now. Go! Nice big head. So I assume at the end we are on the outside of the lower part of the temple and she is on the inside. Yes, of course it's going kaput again. It's still weird to me that you use that word. Because it's a German word. Probably a Latin word. I'm out of the pod. I'm... Uh, I don't know where. It looks like uh, the solar system. What do they call it, this type of model? An oral ring. A map of the stars, made by the people who have never seen them. Doubly amazing, is it not? Okay, I heard that for sure. I should hope so, brother. What good are thoughts if they cannot be spoken? <laughs> <laughs> who the hell are you? How are you? You're not on the radio, are you? No, brother. My flock and I communicate through other more extravagant means. Flock? You have encountered them only briefly to this point, but you will come to know them far more intimately, I fear. The primitives? You're talking about the ones that live here? I am. They are far from primitive. Where I come from, we have an adage. Never judge a man by where he drinks, only by how he holds it. <laughs> okay, I think I get it now. One of us is crazy. To be certain. To be certain, yeah. <laughs> Great. Yes. I know you have questions, brother, but time is short. Move forward, and all will be explained. Though I give no guarantee you will like the answers. <laughs> is that the religious Soviet captain? Has he continued? Did we find his body or not? I'm not 100% certain. I think he was dragged off by the primitives, as Mac Mac calls them. Okay, Mac and Charlie both are, have arrived at the bottom of what we know so far. We're gonna find out what this entire civilization is all about that we find down here. 
And yeah, have a nice day. See you tomorrow with that.